Walker Quarries is a hard rock quarry. It produces aggregates for concrete and various other things. The sand that we produce is coarse and fine sand, which is used in all sorts of things in the construction industry. Walker Quarries approached CDE three or four years ago, looking to improve their product quality, their product output, and basically future-proof their business so they could grow and expand. Because of the challenging nature of the terrain here, we had silt ponds and they had to be cleaned out reasonably regularly. That took labour, equipment, double handling. And at one stage, we were within about three weeks of having to shut down all sand operations because we were overwhelmed with silt. The installation of the plant and equipment here for CDE was the first stage of our five-year plan. This was to alleviate the need for tailing dams. The biggest surprise has been the frugal nature of the water usage. We've set up the drainage, which is supplementary to the sand plant, but any water that comes off the draining sand here all flows back to our storage dam. We actually recycle 85% of our water. We identified with Walker Quarries that they've got a very abrasive material. So in order to make their coarse and fine sand, we've chosen to use a jet pump to move the coarse sand fraction around the plant. This is going to reduce abrasive wear in the plant and make operating a lot easier for the guys. It's got a really great infinity primary screen, which delivers time and time again. It's weld free construction means that it's going to have really great longevity and the PU mat interchangeable for quick change out and easy maintenance. The quality of the steel work the coatings are excellent. It's also set the benchmark now for sustainability in the region. They're recycling more water and making more usable products from what used to be waste products than ever before. We've pushed the plant from 150 tonne to 200 tonne an hour. Once we get into full production, we're going to push that up to about 240. That is another big surprise, the versatility. We're still learning what this plant can do. We did a lot of testing on their materials and there are variable materials coming out of the site to get a really great handle on the gradings of the feed material coming in. This has proven out when we commissioned the plant and it's come up to spec really quickly. Also the importance of specifying the filter press. We need to get a great understanding of how that uh, material is going to behave in that pressing cycle. And again, that early work has proved to be correct and, and paid dividends. We've decreased our clay and silt content in the sand to 1%. The technology that's gone into it is just so simple to run. I can run it from my office on an iPad. I can get all my production information I need from the iPad. CD Smart Techs add a lot of value to the customer because it really simplifies anything related to the plant performance, the plant spare parts, or the preventative maintenance. aftermath of COVID and the global shipping crisis and adverse weather conditions. Challenges do arise, but with an adaptable and flexible working approach between myself and walkers, we're able to come up with solutions. The plant went together really well with its modular process. There was no issues at all. The main objective is to understand how we generate value for our customer. As far as utilising the plant now, as opposed to what we had before, yeah, I'm expecting this plant to, to quadruple our sales.